Right hey guys, welcome back. Another episode of the Glamper Vans. Well, not the Glamper Vans, it's the Glamper. As you can see, I haven't got Christy beside me. I've got Pete, a good mate of mine. Um, we've got an absolute belter of a trip coming up, this one. We've been looking forward to going for quite some time. We haven't done it yet. We're going to the Fink Desert Race. And we're going with a mad crew. Look, I can't list them all. Stay tuned, it's gonna be a belter. done and dusted a uh, little riverside camp just outside of Roma good little spot first night in the swag for a long long time so I put the van in the back and uh, Jesus it was rough in the swag I forget how good the van is but um yeah full crew pulled over roadside just a quick stop a uh, little bit of a rest stretch and uh, away we go again outside of Longridge, you pulled up in a, it's a free camp just outside by the river. It's dry as dry can be, but the weather's good. Last night was pretty chilly. During the day today it was quite pleasant, it was about 28 degrees, so in the swags, I tell you, night number two in the swag. I've been in the swag for about two years, but night number two. Let's see how we go. Might get a little bit better as we get along. Early 
three again. It wasn't too bad last night. Starting to get my head around it. On the way to the Fink. Beautiful sunrise this morning behind me. Just makes you really appreciate what a beautiful country we live in. And we just stopped at the coffee cube and had um, breakfast and it was bang on. So if you're ripping through Winton, the coffee cube, highly recommend it. Put some snaps up of uh, Pete's breakfast. Oh, pancakes and ice cream. He's a dead set dessert connoisseur. But um, yes, we stop, let's keep rolling. Red heels and in my hair Went up all night cause I thought you cared Yeah, just rolled into Cuyuna The famous Blue Heeler Hotel We did stop here a couple of years ago uh, But they've had floods through in January And in, inside the actual bar uh, They said it was metre high full of water So um, I was just looking on the wall over here Everyone writes their name on the wall And I was just looking for our names that we wrote on there last time But I can't find them, there's a million and one names So I'll have to re put her up But um, Cracker of a pub, it's worth stopping. Have a cold one if you're allowed to. Um, but uh, yeah, and keep on trucking. You're calling me saying, babe, don't start a fight. Stop living a fantasy. I'm sorry, excuse me. Big season, how I thought it'd be. This isn't a fairy tale, you promise me. What is the Creek, famous for the movie Crocodile Dundee, that's a uh, pretty iconic Australian movie. Let's go inside and uh, check it out. Super cool memorabilia around everywhere. Some real old school stuff, and um, we're gonna have a quiet ale. What about an apology? Oh, yeah, it's only me. This isn't how I thought it'd be. This isn't the fairy tale you promised me. What is down we're at the old Mary Kathleen uranium mine um, it's just before Mount Isa um, it feels like a dead set ghost town and it used to be a little town so we're up on a couple of concrete slabs crews just settling down for the Arvo we're doing some pretty big miles but um, yeah so far so good awesome trip
guessed it. We have just pulled up at the Barclay Homestead. All the big dog crew have uh, set up over the other side. But uh, not for Shawnee. I'm not rolling swags out in this. I will be in penthouse suite. Number 26. Yeah, come on in. Have a look at these facilities. Barclay Homestead. Single. King single. Over to the right, we've got tea, coffee facilities, TV, no reception, but fridge. You ask what the mystery, mystery door is with the ding in it. Well, it is. Shower, toilet, vanity. Oh, you cannot beat this. Anyway, bunker down here for tonight, back on the road tomorrow. Super pumped now. Just locked the hubs in. Um, it's going to be a little bit rough. We've had a fair bit of rain out here, so red dirt and clay. It's going to be. It's going to be good. It's going to be testing. This is our little humble abode for the next couple of days. We've got our backside, trackside, couple of swags, couple of chairs, nice little fire going. This is living Barry. Absolutely cracking sleep last night. Got up this morning. Fire's still tickering away down here. But um, we're getting a little bit peckish, so we're going to head up to the breakfast bar and um, see what they've got on offer for breakfast out here, I think. Oh, yeah, looks like it's just a continental breakfast this morning. Get some cereal and a cuppa. That'll be lovely. Can't get much better than a lift. This is unreal. town at the moment so it's really starting to ramp up. Let's go and have a look at some of the cars.
We're gonna jump, jump in the TRX. We're gonna take it down the track and see how it goes. We've had our backside trackside all morning. There's been heaps of practice going on behind us. Guys are coming through at dead set 100 mile an hour. It's Friday, scrutineering is on. So we're gonna head into town, check out all the who's who of the zoo in there. It's gonna be awesome. Everyone's gonna be in there. There's a big vibe, everything's pumped up at the moment. So um, even I'm getting excited. The flies are as thick as these, but um, yeah, here we go. Fink 2024. Oh. Sunny Coast. Yeah, sunny Coast. Lovely. Sunday morning, sunrise has just cracked over the back of us here, and it is race day. So, cars will start coming through first, and then the bikes. It's going to be a cracking day, I cannot wait.
after a couple of amazing weeks away, we met some great people along the way. We got into Fink, had an amazing time. We got dirt, we got dust, we got petrol, we got ethanol. We had absolutely everything hammered at us and we loved every minute of it. So if you like to think, get on, like and subscribe. Catch you guys.